a candle pattern stage, if traders have to rely on the candlestick patterns for their investment decision, uh, they must know all the basic things about the candle patterns and their stages. They have to possess the basic ideas on which pattern they should emphasize on or they should ignore. Uh, there are three basic pattern stages. The first stage is the trend. The, uh, prerequisite of any candlestick pattern is the price should be in trend. It can be in an uptrend or downtrend but without a trend the candle patterns cannot be predicted. The second stage is the pattern included in that trend. Blindly following just the pattern without noticing the trend can actually be a harmful decision. So a candlestick can only be predicted properly if they are included in a trend. The third stage of the candle pattern is the confirmation of the pattern. Every pattern has its own confirmation signs. Traders have to find those signs to confirm the pattern and the trend predict the situation. The patterns are commonly bearish, bullish, or continuation patterns. A bearish pattern comes after an uptrend and close with a downtrend. A bullish pattern is situated exactly in the opposite condition. It starts with a downtrend and closes with an uptrend. A continuation pattern is most of the time observed closely by the traders as there uh, is a huge risk in investing in this kind of a situation. Only expert can predict this type of situation correctly. Many people confuse the reverse pattern in the prediction that uh, it will always turn into the opposite trend. But our reversal patterns, the market can reverse or simply continue the price they were uh, possessing before. It's not always about the opposite trend. Before starting or uh, investing according to candlestick pattern, traders should know that candlestick patterns can only influence the market for short time. So there is uh, no surety that the patterns can be 100% accurate at the time of your investment.